guys, it has been a minute, and y'all, I would start getting text as soon as I fucking try to film a video. Anyways, um, I am back in Michigan at my parents' house, um, for summer, and this is where I get all my PR sent to, so I thought it'd be fun to do, like, a little unboxing video of, like, PR so y'all can see what it's like and what I get. Obviously, I'm going to start with the small ones, but let's just dive right in. Maybe I should do, like, <laughs> just kidding. It's not an ASMR video because I know it would be way too loud. Um, what is this? Oh, it is from Laneige. And it is their water clay mask, mini pour. Looks like that. And it comes with like this little sponge. I think it's to take it off. Morphe. Yes. So I have their um, Warm Master blush palette. I'm really excited. Like blush is my favorite favorite makeup product. So let's see this. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited for this shade right here. That looks so good and goals. Yes. Okay, I'm so excited to try this out. What is this? Oh, cute. Okay. We have Red Fruits Brightening Mask and Broccoli Plumping Mask. And these are both vegan. I've never tried this brand before, but Looks promising. We got a cute little lemon bag. Oh, and my sunny. Okay. We got a brush. A lip stain. Is this the color I'll wear? Let's see. Um, maybe. I'm not like a huge. I don't think I wear a lot of pinks. I think I've definitely gotten better with it. We got a uh, hydrating primer from. Tarte Moods Laura Sanchez. I've never tried this makeup brand. It's like this greenish type. I feel like the packaging looks really familiar, but I don't think I've ever tried any of this brand stuff. Okay, we have a nice little Ipsy package there. We love that. You know, Ipsy gel. I think that's what most of these pink packages, except this one, is. is from. Yes. So, we have Hyaluronic Acid Moisturizing Mask from Midflower. This looks good. And that's a blush. Cotton candy blush. This is cute. Like a light little pink. Okay, yeah, she's cute. I like her. Like I said, I am blush fiend, but I still have... I need to find like a good red blush. Um, we have what's the tea from the balm? That's cute. I have to say the balm is always on point with their packaging. And then we have ooh, uh, essential sea cleanser from Murad, and then Smashbox the liquid lipstick here. Love that. The Benefit Bad Gal Bang Mascara, which I actually haven't tried yet. Preventive Measures After Hours Lip Balm. I don't know what that means. It's hemp and peas, though. And we have um, this ooh, cream pigment in Honeydew from Hikari um, Cosmetics. That's interesting. Ooh! HD finishing powder from Bella Pierre, I believe is how you pronounce it. Um, I have these lip glosses from them that I really like. They're like, what's the word? Um, I can't think of it because I'm illiterate. And we have a little nail polish here. Yay! Thank you, Ipsy. This is PR from Room 11 says right here. I'm so blind. Their packaging is so cute. I like that it's like decked out with other brands. Oh wait, okay, there's multiple things in here. They sent me, ah, oh, they know the way to my heart. They know I'm a fucking liner girl. 
I'm just not very brand friendly. They know I'm a liner girl. <laughs> oh my god. They just sent me like all their different types of liners. I love them. What the heck? Define in line with Rimmel and London eyeliners. I love that. So we have like the nude one, which is perfect for waterline. And then you have like the dot one, which is going to be perfect because you guys know I like doing like graphic liner and sometimes I'll put like dots and stuff. So that's perfect. And then you got soft pencil, which I hate hard pencils so much, but I use this to also line my waterline or like smudge underneath. And then we have, oh yes, these are both waterproof. Are they the same thing? Oh no, they have two different tips. And then one's like pointed and one's like chiseled. I'm excited to try that. I haven't really tried a lot like this one. Thick and thin liner. Oh my god. It's from Pure Cosmetics. They gave me their 4 in 1 Selfie Longwear Foundation and Concealer in LN5. Uh, this might be too dark for me. It's like a little pink for me, but I could maybe get it to work and like test it out and let you guys know how it works. Because it looks like it's going to be pretty like, I can't tell, I think it's going to be pretty full coverage. But, oh, Glam Black Bag Plus, it's Ipsy. Okay, okay. Because they recently started doing um, Glam Bag Pluses with full, oh my god, it's been crazy, with full products. And they sent me the Moods palette by, it looks like a little, I don't know what happened to it. Look how cute this packaging is, 10 out of 10, and look at the colors, I'm obsessed. That's so cute. I'm excited to try it. Yeah, Ipsy recently started doing um, full size bags. So you get full size products. This is the Paris Hilton's Dual Action Cleansing Gel. Who else? Oh, this is it. Duh. Who else did not know that Paris Hilton had a skincare line? Because I did not. Um. Feel Balance Moisturizing Balancing Cream. Is this for your body? This is a pretty big bottle. Have from Girlactic. I've never owned their stuff before, but I've like heard of them. Three in one sparkle balm. I think this is for your lips, but I probably will use it on my face. Ugh, they're so pretty though. Wow. Because I think you can see. I'm not wearing my glasses or contacts, so I can't tell if you guys can actually see. And then bright eyes, little under eye dark circle corrector, which we always use because <laughs> we have insomnia. No, sorry, that was wrong. We insomnia. There we go. Get your memes right, Callie. Okay, so for a little bit of information, Ipsy launched Glam Bag Plus late 2018 which featured five full-size beauty products for $25. Um, they're not available to the public. I, have, I got this before it came, but then obviously it was at my parents' house. But, um, um, Anastasia Beverly Hills. But, oh my god. Yo, I swear to God, if something broke, do you see this, like, There's eyeshadow all over the tape, and I'm kind of nervous. I'm opening these out of order because I believe this is my welcome package, and then this is the, um, um, new palette. Actually, I'm not sure what this is and if I can show it on camera. But, oh, I'm struggling. Oh, no, 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 I know what this is. Okay, yeah, I can show it on camera. This is the new little, this is the glow launch. Oh my gosh, so it has like the temporary flash tattoos and then the set of lipsticks. And oh. oh my god, oh my 
god, shut up. Look at this, y'all. The shimmer body oil. Oh my god. I'm so excited to rub this literally all over my entire body. I don't care if I'm not going anywhere, I will be glowing head to toe. And then in the very bottom, we have the set of pigments. I love this packaging. It's easy and idiot proof. Look at how pretty these, pack these pigments are. Oh my god. Um, oh, this one, I'm really intrigued by. It's like this rosy color. It's so pretty. I'm so excited to dry them out. Oh my god. Yes, yes. Thank you, Anastasia. We, this one was my welcome package to their PR list. Which is like so crazy. I can't believe it's been in my like top goal for so long to get on their PR list because I've always been such a huge fan of their products and like it's like one of my top brands. Holy shit! Oh, I don't even know how to show this to you guys. It is just jam-packed with stuff. Okay, okay. Um, okay, this is a bunch of different brushes. You're not gonna cry, no! Okay, we got a new a new little mirror. Cute, we love that. Some more brushes. Oh my god, they sent me a bunch of eyebrow brushes. And mine's so old. My Anastasia brow brush is so old that it's the spoolie is coming off of it. <laughs> but now I don't have to worry about it. Oh my god, shut up! You have to be kidding me right now, like. No, 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 I'm not gonna cry, I'm not gonna cry. Okay, okay, we're good, we're not gonna cry. Look at this. Look at all their lipsticks. Oh my god, I'm gonna spend like the rest of the day swatching everything. Literally, no, I'm not gonna cry, okay. Okay, we have their powder bronzer, um, another powder bronzer, and then these are all blush trios. What was I just saying? I need a red blush. Aha, we got one there. We love blushes. I'm like, ah, I don't know how to express my emotions right now. Okay, so in here we have the dark brown brow powder duo, the waterproof jet cream color, and the dip brow pomade. We have what are these? Hold up, let me. So this is oh, it's like a little baby single eyeshadow palette, but it only has the one. Cute. It's nice. I have room to like add some into that, and then these, if I'm right. Holy shit! Shut up! Look at it! Oh my god! Yo! Oh my god, the colors! Y'all see this? And then I can use that little palette for like when I'm traveling and stuff. I don't want to put that somewhere where it's gonna fall. Okay. <sighs> Those parts are exciting. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. So like, I couldn't afford all the new palettes they were coming out with, so like, to be able to have them now is just like, insane. <sighs> this is a prison palette. Look how beautiful this is. I love Sphere and Osiris. Oh my god. And Eden and Saturn and Throne and they're all beautiful. That's the moral of the story. And the packaging. The Norvino palette. My girl, Norvina, I love you. You are my bitch. Oh my god, yes. She is so pretty. Love, oh my god, soul. Ugh. And Celestial and Wild Child. So gorgeous. I'm so obsessed. Love this 
Rose palette so much the colors in it. Like, oh my god, Bahamas, Canes, and Harrods. Like, literally the whole palette is so amazing. And like, I, like to me it screams summer. Oh my god. Then we got a new Modern Renaissance palette, which I'm actually giving to my boyfriend's little sister because I already have this palette so it's like pointless for me to have a second one and it's brand new and I'm not gonna give her my old one so I'm handing over that new one and then the soft glam palette ah look at Milbury so pretty oh my god there's so many endless look possibilities with all of these like what 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 so what is my life right now what is my life child palette y'all know me y'all know I already own this because it was like perfect for me so I'm gonna be probably gifting this one too because I already have it and there's no reason for me to keep a second one ah cream contour kit this used to be my girl and then I mixed it had like dried up and I mixed oil in it and then I realized the oil made me break out so I stopped using the palette but that's my girl. That's my girl. For contouring. That's my bitch. Oh, Lord, I love you. God is good. And then underneath it, I've never owned this one. This is the, the powder contouring kit. And mind you, when I said I own the, the, um, the one glow kit, that's the only glow kit I've ever owned. This is the sugar one. Um, can we talk about how beautiful Marshmallow is for a second? That's gonna look so good because I'm pale as fuck. And some, you know, just some highlighters don't look good on pale girls, but. Oh my god. Ugh. This is so gorgeous. Too dark for me, but oh my god, so gorgeous. And Moonstone and Summer. I'm gonna die like I'm going to be dripping head to toe and shimmer from the body oil to that in the dream a glow kit I love these so much like look at these colors like the pinks the purple <sighs> I'm so happy right now this is like Christmas it's literally like Christmas like I don't even know I got my little keychain. We got my little pin. It's a uh, like, little enamel pin of tweezers. So cute. And then we have like a little keychain. I'll probably put on like my regular keys. And then we got a sharpener. I lost my other sharpener from Urban Decay, so this is perfect. And I know she works well. And then. A little sponge. Okay, what do we have here? We have clear brow gel. God bless. I'm running out, and it's just like the Maybelline one. We then we have oh the brow is brow definer, waterproof gel liner. We have the like tinted brow gel, and then the perfect brow pencil. My brows are set, set. And then, oh, this is their stick foundation, and they sent me, like, a couple different shades so I can find my shade. I need, I just got lipstick on this. And then we have the dewy setting spray, you know what? <laughs> oh my god, that feels so Yes, look at this girl, look at her, and I love that it has the lock on it, so if I, when I'm like traveling and flying, like I don't have to worry about it in my bag, or like the cap breaking or anything like that. Okay, so then we have loose highlighters, we have Snowflake, um, y'all already know I'm gonna love that one, and then we have Sunset Aura, she killed, she killed. And then sell Hollywood. And the packaging, like, come on. Like, you know my 
ass is don't going to be displaying this stuff. joking me oh my god oh my god can we just talk about like this color here this color like this one this red oh my god oh my what what did I do to deserve this like oh my god like ah We have the Anastasia tweezers, um, brow scissors, and then the like little brow stencils, which my brows are thick, but like, oh, oh my god. <laughs> I don't know if you guys have ever seen me this excited in a video before because it's just, it's so surreal and this video is, okay, it's only 15 minutes and we'll edit some out so it could be worse. I just like, ah, I can't believe that this is my life. And like, I know, like, I work hard and stuff like that, but I really easily discredit myself because to me, I'm really bad at comparing myself to others. And I lost my scissors again. What is wrong with me? See, a failure. <laughs> oh, wait, they're right here, okay. And I just always compare myself to others and I'm really easy to be like, you know, there's so many better people out there, like, I know it's like a really bad mentality to have and like, trust me, like everyone's always like, don't compare yourself to others and girl, if I could just not compare myself to others, I would, you know what, I didn't choose to have a life where I constantly compare myself to others and like the people that I wish that I look like or could be. Ah! Okay, okay, let me <laughs> figure out the easiest way to do this without getting confetti everywhere. This is the Alyssa Edwards palette and PR box. Look at her. I am shook. Okay, okay. I've been waiting so long, like, seeing everyone post with their fans and their mirrors, and oh my god. Like, can we talk about this mirror? Like, I feel like the baddest bitch alive. The baddest bitch alive with this. And the fan. Oh my god, okay, hold on. I'm gonna do, is it this way? Like, bitch. Bitch. Bitch, bitch, bitch. What? 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 Like, weebies. <laughs> oh my god. Tell me why I literally low-key just want to hang this up and like just have it as a showpiece like but like at the same time I could use it when I put on setting spray and then we have the actual palette the whole showstopper okay yes yes Do y'all see these colors? I have been waiting for this for so long. Look at Brick Row. Look at Texas Man. Dream It. Believe. DDG. Like Unicorn Trap. Like what? Believe. Beyond. These are so gorgeous. A headliner. Like I love this palette so much. And seeing everyone current looks with it, I was like, I can't wait to go home and get my baby. <laughs> y'all already know. Y'all already know. Video coming. Where I'm using this palette. And that doesn't sound very convincing because <laughs> when I upload videos, like, I promise, you know what, it's going to happen. It's going to happen. I'm grateful for all of this and, like, 
a lot of it wouldn't be for like if I didn't have people watching me and it's so weird to me to know that people watch me especially when I get you guys like coming back and commenting on my videos like again and again like to know that you're continuously watching my videos and looking forward to them it's like such a weird surreal feeling because like I'm that person for other youtubers you know like it's just really hard to imagine people doing that for me and it's just like so surreal and like honestly my favorite thing is going through YouTube comments and replying to them that's like part of my best days and like some of the comments that I get on here they literally when I tell you it makes my day like it actually makes my day like my week everything there's still comments that I get that like I think back on and I'm like this is why I'm doing this like not only is it like a hobby to me and it's self-expression for me and an outlet but it is for other people too and it encourages them to like you know get started on it and to go out and I've had people leave comments and being like you know I don't wear makeup out and I'm, I'm afraid to like wear these looks out and stuff but watching your video has inspired me to like go out and wear this and like that's so crazy like what like what like I love you guys and anyone who watches and supports me and like to have Oh my god, I'm... <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay. To have, like, big brands put you on their PR list. Like, that's telling you that they believe in your work and they support your work and what you're doing in your craft. And, like, that's the best feeling in the world. Like, I... Like, PR lists aren't validations of how good your work is. But, like, at the same time for someone who's hard on themselves like they see it as like a validation if that makes sense like there's a lot of obviously like amazing artists who like aren't discovered yet and things like that so it's your work's still amazing but like it just makes me feel really good to have friends that I have loved since I was 13 and stuff like that be behind me and thank you yeah to everyone watching and to brands that send me their stuff to try out sorry it took five years for me to get, to get back here and open all these PR packages like life's been crazy but I'm here now so <laughs> anyways thank you for watching this video and I will see you guys in my next video bye